is, let's go ahead and get started. My name is Nicole D. Miller, author of When Love Wins. When Love Wins is an urban Christian fiction story depicting two young female cousins with a rift in their relationship. When Natalie, the faith-based social justice advocate writer, loses her mom, she turns to her cousin Ashley and uncle for grief support. Unfortunately, instead of a warm welcome, she receives an icy cold one from Ashley, the fashionista urban socialite slash artist. And we learn that Ashley is feeling some kind of way that her ex Darren is feeling Natalie, but there seems to be more to the story. This book deals with childhood trauma, bullying, parent absenteeism, grief recovery, and so much more. To learn more, you can go to whenlovewins.love and order your copy today. All right, let's get started. So you guys know that every week I do a piggyback off of my blog called... <laughs> Why am I losing the name of this? Word of the Day Wednesdays, thank you. Um, you guys know I do a piggyback off of my latest blog called Word of the Day Wednesdays. And Word of the Day Wednesdays is just a way for you to be privy to what I've written about this past week um, in a way that you may have missed if you don't read your emails or you're not on my email list. Here's a nice little way that you can get a summary. So the last post that I just um, published this week is called When It's Time to Go. <laughs> okay, and so I give an in-depth uh, story of my experience being in a position where I was undervalued, used, and minimized and overly criticized. It was a horrendous experience. And I've kind of alluded to it um in my previous blogs but this time i like fleshed it out right so i basically share about how i was in a position and i knew that i was being um i knew that it was racism that was coming towards me from a particular individual and i was being under attack my work was being under attack I was very insecure and just really distraught and I've never been in a position like that before. I've always had such a great work ethic. I've always been valued by leadership, you know, so this is my first experience with that and it was horrendous. And in this blog, I just talk about the nitty gritty of that. So if you have a work experience where you feel like you just were going through it, and you can relate and you need to pick me up or you have your own testimony check out the blog at nicoledmiller.com you can also shoot me an email and share your story at info at ndmillerpublishing.com and you know just along the theme of worth and value what i say in this particular blog is surround make sure your circle is a reflection of your worth so surround yourself with people, with um, businesses who understand who you are and what you're worth and that they will rise to the occasion of meeting your standards because they value you and vice versa, right? So anyways, that's basically what the last blog post is about. I am gearing up for my next event. It's been a minute. I took a little break because I'm still recovering with my back issues, but the good news is I'm doing better. And so the next event will be the Author Alley at Loganberry Books off Larchmere. So if you're in the area, please, please, please come through. It's this Saturday from 12 to 4.30. Your girl will be there selling these, signing these, taking pictures with these. Come through, come through. I would love to see you. And then I have some other pots that are kind of cooking on the oven, but you need to subscribe to my email list to be privy of everything that I'm doing. So please subscribe at NicoleDMiller.com. All right, that is what I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you next week for Word of the Day Wednesdays.